What's up everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of the MessageBird platform and its features. MessageBird is an omni-channel automation platform that can help you create automation uh, such as like automatic messages and uh, send them through different channels like Facebook, SMS and voice messages amongst uh, others and to stay in contact and reach your clients better and grow your business. So. Uh, you need to go to their website, that's messagebird.com, and you will land on their uh, like homepage right here. And in here, you will find some screenshots. So uh, they give you some examples of the automations, so like the um, automation messages that are sent to you, like in SMS and so on, and some screenshots. And here's some statistics, some numbers, some features, and uh, they say that it integrates with like WhatsApp, uh, Facebook messaging, uh, messenger like Google, uh, Instagram and others. So um, here you get some statistics, some companies that uh, trust and use message word and so much more. So uh, let's get started. First, you'll need to uh, sign in here if you already have an account or you can start now to create your account. However, let's first take a look at their pricing. Now, uh, here, depending on, of course, the country, you can select the country and the uh, currency, depending on the number of, uh, or sorry, the type of the contact or communication that you want to uh, start with. So for SMS, it's starting at like this price for United States and for numbers, for voice messaging, uh, the price, of course, will uh, change. For email here, uh, as you can see here, the price is also an for omni-channel like SMS, email, uh, WhatsApp, and so on. So you can uh, see the price and see also the details for the type of messages and so on. So for SMS here, uh, you can like uh, enter the, uh, show the prices per SMS and per or per message and so on. So let's um, go back to the main page right here. Okay, back again. And let's uh, start now, click on start now. And in here, you can sign up or create your free account with Google, or you can create an account with email and password. So I'll create uh, an account with uh, my email and enter your password, and I'll get back to you. Uh, okay, now it needs to verify my email. I used, of course, a uh, for this, uh, sort of for the sake of this tutorial to show you a fake uh, email. So I'll need to verify my uh, email address. So let's go to the fake email page right here and um, view the inbox here. I have a message from MessageBird to activate my email. So um, let's open it. Of course, you wanna, you'd wanna sign up with your uh, real main email and you'll get this message in your email. So let's activate the email or verify uh, my email. And here, my account is now verified and I can now log in with my company email or the email that I entered and one password. So I'll uh, log in and show you how it will look like. Okay, now once I um, like uh, signed in and like when once you uh, verify your email, enter your email password, you will land on this page right here. So it'll ask for some basic detail like your first name, last name, and um, how do you want to get started with a message bird. So let's say um, SMS marketing, let's say I uh, use message bird to send SMS or automatic automatic SMS messages to uh, my clients. So I'll enter my name right here and then click next. And then here you will want to enter your phone number. So uh, choose uh, your countries. Let's uh, say I'm in the United States. I'll enter my phone number and then uh, like uh, it'll send a verification code here, uh, SMS to verify your uh, phone number. Okay, now once I confirm my uh, phone number, my mobile phone number, uh, I'll be asked to enter my company name. So let's enter my or how to simple, that's the name of my YouTube channel, um, the company website. So let's enter like anything like how to simple dot com um of course you'll need to enter your real website so the country of legal activity let's select uh, united states 
United States, okay, US. Now, uh, where do you want your data to be hosted in uh, like, um, okay, change, select anything, then save and continue. Okay, enter a valid URL, go to simple.com. Uh, I don't see what's wrong with this URL. So, okay, HTTPS, okay, uh, how to simple.com, okay. Now, uh, once you enter all the details, they will set up your main dashboard and we'll see how it will look like. Okay, so here is my main dashboard. Okay, um, you can complete these steps to uh, connect your e-commerce store if you have an e-commerce store, so you can connect like Shopify, your WooCommerce, or your Magneto to store and import your contacts, uh, select your channels, and so on. So uh, we want, we don't want to set up uh, right now, so we will go straight to our dashboard. Okay, so here is my main dashboard, of course. I haven't uh, created any campaigns or any recipients and haven't sent anything so that they, they do not show. Uh, now here um, I can view or like choose a channel. So here I have SMS, email, WhatsApp, uh, chat, Facebook Messenger, Instagram Messenger and Line. So I can select a channel here to um, start uh, creating uh, like messages and I can also view additional channels. So here I can go to developers and API uh, to view their settings. Of course, uh, once it, the page uh, loads up here. In here, you can set up an originator, set up an SMS channel, and by a number, set up a WhatsApp channel in WhatsApp. So these are the APIs for different channels for SMS and for WhatsApp, uh, for email and so on. So this is the home screen. Now, uh, in the grow customers tab here, I can view my contacts. So here, this used to be contacts in like the old interface. Um, okay, let's uh, close this pop-up. Now, I have all my contacts here. I haven't, I don't have any contacts uh, yet. So I can set up a channel here or I can import my contacts. So if I click here on import my contacts, I can upload like a... Um, let's close this pop-up. I can upload like a CSV file with all my contacts. Uh, I can import list or create my first list and audience, so on. So uh, here I have the sign up forms here. So a new, I can create new sign up uh, forms here. Uh, however, I do not want to do this right now here. I can create the content. So I have messages, I have the uh, emails here. So I can create my first project here. So uh, let's choose the platform. Let's choose the SMS. Any type, message type, I can choose between text and image. Let's choose text, so the most basic type. So uh, the project name is, uh, let's name it test project. And default location, uh, default lo local, sorry, so it's in English. Uh, get started with from scratch or create with AI. So I can start building my template from scratch here. I can get started from this button right here. So let's click on get started and I can create my project from scratch in the editor right here. So let's go back and here in the engage customers, I have uh, the campaigns. Okay, let's close this out. have the campaigns here. I can create a new campaign and I have the journeys and here I can analyze the performance so I can get uh, some insights and uh, statistics and reports. However, of course, I haven't created anything. So uh, channel performance, campaign performance, I can uh, view the performance of everything right here. And I can enable channels. So I have many channels here. I have the SMS, email, uh, WhatsApp, Facebook Messenger, uh, Instagram Messenger, chat and line. And here I can uh, view numbers. So uh, the long code numbers and short code numbers as well. So in here, if I choose the uh, channel, I can install it. So for SMS here, I can install the channel to uh, send, be able to send SMS and they'll give you like a guide on how to install it and what to do uh, once you install and before installation. Here you can automate work. You have support customers, notifications, and of course your uh, profile info. So um, for now, let's try to install SMS right here. If I click on install, I need to uh, buy or select any number. So here 
it gives you an option to the option to buy a number from a specific country so we are located in the united states so let's say i want to buy a united states uh, number of course you can buy numbers for the countries uh, of which in which you want to do your business so the type is like mobile prefix okay select uh, capabilities sms mms voice okay so the number should uh send all this okay let's deselect voice and sms okay let's disable everything okay no numbers found okay that's strange okay however in this this is the place in which you would buy numbers to create your campaign so um here is like my navigation menu i can here i'm in the sms marketing i can go to the organization settings and switch organizations view documentations and get support so this was like a quick overview of the message bird platform and its features